Today is an interesting day. Um, we, for the past few weeks, we are a uh, training fan. We are going for trainings with him, and today we have a special training. We are going to have a training in a shopping center. It's going to be different. And I don't know how it's going to look like, but uh, apparently our trainer is taking us to different kinds of situations uh, with our dog to see how to manage them. And today is going to be a different one uh, in a shopping center. So curious about it. to get approval on my last video. You approve? I'm not going that much to trainings or uh, mainly it's the studio that walks Sven out during the day because yeah, I'm busy. At home. <laughs> Don't you see differences? <laughs> yes, I do see difference in a way uh, how eagerly he jumps into his cage. He's more I calm. See. He's more calm and, and I think he's running more away from Gaia. So he doesn't get that aggressive, but still, Gaia gets more aggressive, I think. Yeah, and, and then moving even. We need to send Gaia for training also. <laughs> oh man, our baby is very active. And running from morning until night. Yes. Some and tips even, how to and even deal the, with the babies like that. <laughs> walking the dog, look at how he's walking and I'm strength. Oh yeah, I have to admit that walking with him it's way, way easier and much more pleasant. is that we started to feed him more outside of course that sometimes when it rains or it's cold or windy we give him food at home but we just take this pocket uh, full of uh, his food and we give him his meals on the walk and this way he's focused on uh, on us during the walks and he's not going around and even when he cross uh, by pass by another dog he's not so like running towards the dog and it's been very helpful and less stressful so if someone has a similar situation like we had a few months ago my biggest advice is to look for a professional that can help you um, taking care of this and they will know how to do and and they can put you in uncomfortable uh, situations with your dog but also they will help you to solve those problems um, because Sven only tried to attack our training like 10 times. Yeah, we had nine, tra nine trainings. 
Yes, and if you're training to try to attack more than once. <laughs> so. Not true. No, no. No, come on, the walks we had in the park. No, now it got mm -hmm. get much better. Uh, and yeah, that's the thing, we only had nine trainings. We have 15, 16 more to go. So I'm really impressed. What I actually really like about this training is that we built relationship with our dog. And that's funny. We are looking for a new harness for him. Maria doesn't like it. We had the, before the situation that under is uh, it's not armpits, <laughs> how you call it? Yeah, kind of. Like, no! Uh, yeah. Now that we are waiting for the train to pass, we had problems behind, under his armpits that it was just too much, you know, burned or from the, the, the rubbing. So uh, we are waiting for your suggestions. <laughs> 